Hey Ross World, my money makes money. Now this is a second video in this sort of chain of blockchain, sort of chain of Bitcoins. Now it has nothing to do with Bitcoins. And matter of fact, these are alternative cryptocurrencies to Bitcoin. So they're really trying to push Bitcoin out the way, even though Bitcoin is the pioneer of the bunch. But these are alternate coins that people will be using around the world. Now, Bitcoin, once again, I said in my very first video, not the one that really broke down Bitcoin, but the very first one that you can reference right here, how Bitcoin, the price is getting ridiculous to even purchase or buy or exchange or mine one, have you. So here's some alternate cryptocurrencies that are out or will be out in order for you to get into it early if you so choose to. So please excuse me as I look down and I read some information and I'll leave the link in the description of where I reference this so you can go and look at all the details. Once again, I'm only giving you the meat and potatoes. All right, let's get it. Litcoin. Litcoin set itself up as a silver to Bitcoin's gold. Confirmation of transactions are currently processed more quickly with Litcoin than Bitcoin. Now, Litcoin was created in 2011. Peercoin. Peercoin markets itself as using less energy and being more environmentally sustainable than some of the other coins on the market. It says it is designed to have a 1% rate of inflation. Prime coin. With this coin, miners have to use their computers to find Cunningham chains, which are sequences of prime numbers. Prime coin touts the mining of such prime numbers, such as providing potential scientific value in addition to minting and security for the network. Now, I know this is a lot of jargon about all this stuff, but the more information you guys get on this, the more you'll understand. Right now, it's like reading a rocket science book in Russian. Namecoin. Namecoin was created to explore the record-keeping side of cryptocurrency technology. It acts as a peer-to-peer -peer decentralized domain system for dot bit domains. People can purchase dot bit domains with Namecoin and then Namecoin tracks the transaction in the blockchain or the public ledger. Don't forget about that public ledger, that blockchain, where all the transactions are kept for anyone and everyone to look at. Ripple. Ripple has already attracted millions in venture capital, including from Google, including from Google Ventures. In contrast to Bitcoin, there is no mining of Ripples. Ripples also is set up as a payment network not only for Ripple, but for the other currency and such as an automated system for currency trades. You might want to look into Ripple because Google's in it. Believe me, it may take off. Sex coins here. <laughs> Sex coins. This is a good one. This is actually real, guys. I'm not, even throwing, I'm not even fucking with you. According to its website, the goal of Sex Coin to have a way for consumers of adult content to have a fast, stable, and secure method of transaction that protects their privacy. So instead of you paying like your information through your credit card or through a wire transfer to look at your porn sites, now they can't even track that. You will use your sex coin. Sugar, sugar, bang, bang. Quark, Quark, that's Q-U-A-R-K. The Quark coins uses nine rounds of encryptions to ensure security and autonomy in its, in its transaction. The Quark coin uses nine rounds of encryption to ensure security and autonomy in its transactions. It claims that because Quark is mined using regular computer processing power, it offers the fairest distribution mode available. I have no idea what, what that means. Freecoin or Freycoin, F-R-E-I coin. Freecoin imposes a particular fee of about 5% annual on money held by users, meaning that users who hoard their money instead of spending it will see their money fall in value. I, I, wow. I don't got nothing to say about that. You keep your money and your money falls in value because you didn't spend it. Free coin my ass. Mastercoin. Created to address some of the security and price stability issues of Bitcoin, it implements more advanced features on top of the blockchain. It appears the importance of Mastercoin is more in its technology than in its currency. So, security. NXT, now you have a name, NXT. NXT, like Ripple, does not build on the Bitcoin code. Instead, it uses its own code 
written from Java software, which you've heard of Java. And don't forget about Ripple with Google. I may look into that. Aurora Coin, Aurora Coin, A U R O R A Coin, was created after a Icelandic entrepreneur came up with the idea of, of distributing cryptocurrency to everyone in his country. Aurora Coin is based on the Lit Coin and is 50% pre mined. The pre mined coins will be distributed to the entire population of Iceland beginning at midnight, March 25th. So basically, this guy's being a pioneer getting into this cryptocurrency, and he's giving his country these Aurora, these Aurora coins, which I believe at one point, all these particular coins are going to get together and say, yeah, we can do these. And right now, like the sex coin, the pot coin, they're used for a particular service on the internet through internet transaction to keep autonomy so people don't know uh, who it is, but they will know you based on the transaction level, but not what the actual transaction was, just the amount of the transaction. This guy right here is an innovator. He's a pioneer. He's trying to make sure that Iceland stays up on current terms in a financial market. And last but not least, Doggy Coin or D O G E Coin. This alternate coin initially started as a joke by combining two internet phenomenal Bitcoins and the Dodge meme. It's one of the most talked about cryptocurrencies behind Bitcoin, which may explain in part is growing market of capital. And it doesn't hurt that his mascot is an adorable puppy. Okay, so that's basically it. And don't forget, by honorable mention, popcorn. Believe it or not, popcorn, if you look it up, is an actual thing. People are going to be using popcorn, which is a cryptocurrency, in order to do transactions and purchase marijuana for recreational and also medical services. So that was a long list of Bitcoins. Go and research them for yourself. I'm going to leave the link in the description for you to research them and understand what all these coins are about because we never know money just might turn virtual. This is Ross World. I'm out.